Hello guys, this is Peter, and welcome to another episode of Tutorial Tuesday. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make a 3D abstract cube shape for Cinema 4D. This is what we're probably going to make close to it. And so, let's get started. This is what I've done so far, but we're going to start new, and yep. So... The first one you can do is make a cube, move this up a little bit, this yellow arrow right here. Then what you're going to want to do is go to uh, MoGraph, Cloner Object, Cloner, drag the cube into the cloner, click on the cloner, and uh, not move it by these or it's just going to move up and down. Move it by these right here. So move this sideways. Sorry. When I first want to go to mode grid array, go to the um size and this is what we're gonna do. Pretty much we're gonna want to make this about 430 each. It's all up to them. So we get this cube shape. So next what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna want to make sure you click on cloner, go to MoGraph, go to uh, vector, random effector. So you get a lot of random cubes now. This is where you get more detail and then it's a lot more fun to make sure you click on it. Go to um this is what is like it's gonna make it about your x axis your y and your z if you want this to be more it's pretty much how you want it spread out and lay down up and down sideways etc i just customize it what you like you know copy the settings i'm just putting pretty much everything up to 100. it's good And then what you want to do is go to scale, uniform scale. This is going to get the cubes bigger and smaller, so make this about right there. I like it all about the same almost. And then click on rotation, and you can rotate the cubes of what you like. I like it this way. Make everything, I make everything about 50. And yeah, so just you gotta get what you like the best, as you see here. And keep. Ah, so just play around with the settings. I'm not doing anything special. I'm just doing something fast, quick. So then, what you want to do is find a spot where you kind of want to end it. It's a pretty just quick. So it looks like so far. Looks nice, but not really too good. Oh, no. Wait, I'm going to go again. good now we're gonna add a you don't have this you can buy it there I'll leave in the description in the, um, the website to type in the grayscale gorilla in the Google and you can buy it you get a lot of presets of soft boxes and lights and like really nice stuff so I'm at a soft box you might not have this but you can buy it that's only it's not really too expensive so it looks like this Get this really nice effect. So now what you want to do is make a new um a new material, a new specular. 
good um color and uh, let's do this. I'm gonna make mine a genius or something. I think it's about a blue reflection texture pencil pencil brightness about to 10 and mixed drink about to 10 add blurriness if you want so it's not too much sharp edges mix it out now drag this onto your cube and everything's blue <laughs> but some people don't like that so if you want to get other colors into it push control or command if you're on a map Command C, Command B, or Control C, Control B. Drag this under the cloner object. Then do the same with this. Um, click on this. Com command C, Command B, or Control C, Control B. And push Edit. Then just change the color. I want a like a gray. Right there. Push OK. All right. All right. Alright, so we're gonna um just drag this on to one of them. That. And that's pretty much what it is so far, so much. You see here. It's really coming along now. You can leave it at like this if you want, but we're gonna add um we're gonna move this down and then add a okay, we're gonna add a sky. You want the sky down in. Make it what you like, but um let me just do this change color real quick. And add it to dark. Alright, there we go. No, actually come on a little bit darker. Alright, let's go. Then drag this onto the sky and it's nice we got some shadows. And then go click on this, go to um uh, uh wait, go to effect, add ambient inclusion and global illumination and click this. And this is, should be the final product. As you see, you got the really nice um, shadows and stuff. A millionaire, I'm a young money millionaire, tougher than Nigerian hair. My criteria compared to your career, this isn't fair. I'm a venereal disease. Yeah, it looks really nice. I like this really good background. So you can make it a background if you want, but you don't have to have this background if you want. Just have the shape. If you want to do that, then you can save it. Um, it's Tut Tuesday. Episode. Make it a PNG if you or if you want it to be um the background with the alpha channel and make your output of what you want to want each key, etc. Make it a um still image, not a video, it's gonna take a long render animation I should say. So that's about it. Thank you for watching and please comment and Yep. <laughs> Alright, see you guys. Bye.